The best way to make money online is by selling products. You can sell Amazon products if you don't have your own product and make real money. Amazon has a vast collection of products, so the possibility is vast. But there is a catch. You have to face huge competition and challenges with customer handling. Don't worry, today I will introduce an AI-powered platform that will help you to stand ahead of all. So, without further ado, let's dive in. This is Devit and you are watching AI Lockup. Introducing VOC AI, a one-stop solution for marketers and e-commerce. This amazing AI-powered platform can do market insight, sentiment analysis, customer analytics, analyze Amazon reviews, competitive analysis, product research, and consumer insights across all social media. You can see another feature called AI Chatbot. It's a very important feature. Now you don't need to hire a customer support agent. This AI Chatbot will act as the customer support agent for you. And today, I will share the method of using this incredible feature of VOC AI. You can integrate this chatbot into your website. GPT powers this chatbot and the board will use your website pages for the data source. All the replies will come from the data you have on your website pages. For the data source, you can add custom files along with the pages you have on your website. This is one of my demo e-commerce websites. It is running on WordPress. And today, I am going to integrate this AI chatbot into this website. So, what do we need to do? First of all, head over to Vok AI. I will put the link in the description box. Once you are on this page, click on sign up from here and then create an account. Once the account is created, you will find two options. VOC and AI Chatbot. VOC is for e-commerce brands consumer insights enhanced by AI, and AI Chatbot is for 7x24H professional intelligent customer chatbots powered by AI. Here I will select the AI Chatbot. Now we have to set up the appearance of the chatbot. First of all, the name of the chatbot. I am giving a name according to my demo website name. Next, select the industry. As my website is an e-commerce website, I am selecting e-commerce. If you want to use any other website like business, review, and others, select others from here. Once you are done, hit the next button. And here it is our AL Shop AI chatbot has been created. Now we have to configure and test the chatbot. First of all, we have to build a knowledge base. Click on the knowledge base button from here. You will get three options to train your bot, web learning, document learning, and Q&A library. If you want to enter the question and answer manually, you do it from the Q&A library tab. If your data is in a file like PDF, then come to the document learning tab, click on the upload document button, and then upload the related document. As I already have an e-commerce website and all the products are added, I will go with the web learning option. Now click on the add a link button from here. Now add the link in this box. I am copying my demo website URL and then pasting it into Vok AI. On the bottom of the page, you will find an option called whole site learning mode. If you want to train with all content on the website based on the sitemap, then turn it on. And if you want to train with only the current web page entered, then turn it off. Once everything is set, hit the identify button. Now VOC AI will analyze the website and detect all the pages or links on your website. You can select the pages you want to use. OK, now click on the next button from here. Now it will take some time to train the model. Let's fast forward this part. OK, the training is completed. Now click on the test button from here to test the AI chatbot's capability. This is the testing playground. Let's ask something. For example, I am typing, do you have heels? As you can see, it suggests the product with the image and link. Now if you click on the link, it will redirect to the product page. That's great. On the left side of the testing playground, you will find some settings. First, the agent introduction. Here is the information of the AI agent. Next, in the global settings, here you will find multiple options. If you enable the multi-round conversation value, then the AI agent won't respond after the round. Next, reveal AI identity. When enabled, the AI chatbot reveals its identity as an AI, otherwise, it conceals its AI identity and provides human-like responses. After that, repeat the answer control and high-risk information will be handed off. My suggestion is to keep them on. In the end, the switch to manual setting. This option is for when the AI doesn't have the answer according to your train data. And then here is the answer template. You can change it. Alright, we are done with config and test. Now come to the left side panel of the page. Here you will find some other settings. 
If you want to train the model and input more data, then you can do it from here. The next setting is the competence setting. Here you can add logistic inquiries and purchase inquiries. You can link your Shopify store in the logistic inquiry settings. I am skipping this option at this moment. It's very simple. Okay, the next setting is system integration. This is very important. Here you will find the option to integrate your AI chatbot on your system. You will find a vast number of options here. We will go with LiveChat, as we want to integrate it into our website. Now we can configure the chatbot from here. First of all the appearance and personalization. Here you can add AI chatbot avatar. Choose live chat icon, AI chatbot name, signature, resident function, live chat dimensions, and theme color. In the end, you will find the model output setting. Once everything is set, hit the save button. Alright, after the appearance and personalization configuration, you will find the trigger configuration. First of all, the welcome message trigger. By default, the welcome message is, Hi. What can I help you with? You can enter your custom message. I will go with the default. Next, the login information. It's the personal information that needs to be filled out by the user before starting the conversation. I think email is perfect because it will leave an email to contact later. Next, you can set, prompt user inquiry, collect customer satisfaction, automatically end conversation, maximum reply rounds, and privacy policy. Once everything is set, hit the save button. Alright, now the integration code, we can copy the code and insert it into our website. Another option is the web chat room. With this option, you can copy the chat room link and share it with others. Now if we visit this link, you will notice the AI chatbot. But we want to integrate with our website. So, copy the integration code and go to your WordPress dashboard. Now on my website dashboard, I will embed this code into the footer. So I will go to Appearance, Widgets, and here I will find the footer column. So here under the footer column, I will add one more block. That will be HTML block and I will paste the code here and update it. Now I will refresh the page. So you see this chatbot here. I will click on this and this is our chatbot. To chat with the bot you need to enter your email. So I will use a demo email here. Now I can chat. Since this is an e-commerce website. So I will ask do you have watch? We have a fantastic collection of watches available and all of this. It provides the link for the product. So if I click on this, I'll go to that page. So this will be very helpful for the visitor. When someone comes to your e-commerce store, they don't need to scroll through all the pages and they don't need to search. They can just chat with the bot and find the product. Now let's ask, do you have an AI lockup subscription plan? It says please wait for our team and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. This means it didn't find any watch so it transferred the chat to a live agent. So if I go to the dashboard and select the inbox, here you see under all chat I have this and it says please wait for our team because of lack of knowledge. It didn't reply because of a lack of knowledge. So if I select to transfer to the agent and now I can reply, you see all the chats here that were transferred to the agent and here under AI response, you will see all the chats that the chatbot handled. So I'll go to the transfer agent and I say hi. When I say hi here, I can go to this page and see the chat. It's coming from the live agent. What do you want to know about AI lockup? Now the person can chat with the agent and the agent will provide all the information the person needs. So you see this is how the chatbot works. So this chatbot can help the visitors and it can increase the conversion rate of your website. If you don't have an e-commerce website, if you have a normal website like a business website, it can provide all the information you have on your business website to the visitors. When I go to the inbox, I see the AI response. Here I can see the email of that person. So later I can contact this person with the email. In conclusion, this AI agent chatbot is very useful for any marketer or service provider. So, don't forget to try this AI chatbot. You can try this tool for free, but if you are serious about your business, then you should buy the pro plan. Another good news is, you will get 20% discount by using coupon code AI Lockup. Alright friends, I will wrap up our video now. Before that, I would love to hear your opinion about the VOC AI chatbot. Share your thoughts and results in the comments section below. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to our channel for more amazing tutorials like this one. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, happy creating!